Hey, Hash, all things dentistry. You know, one of the most difficult things is the slob rule during x-rays, during root canals, and I get it. Take a different type of file, place it in one of the canals, do a mesial or distal shift, and see what happens. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to place a head shrimp file. So a head shrimp file has a different cross-sectional diameter, so that's our regular K file, most of them. And then there's our head shrimp file, so it's got a, it's, it's, it's a circle, essentially. So it's used for much more aggressive filings. I'm going to place our file, so I'm going to place this at 20 millimeters into our mesial buccal canal. Right there, and we'll push that down to length. This gives us a different, you can kind of see the shape difference. I'm going to place that in the mesial lingual. I'm going to spin that down. It may not go to working length. And actually, I don't want it to. Let's try the distal shift to start. Okay, so now we've taken our radiograph, and right away you can like zone in on this head shrimp file, which looks totally different than our regular K file. And you know what? The, the slob rules still apply, absolutely. And this is one simple way to learn the slob rule. But you know, in the crisis, and you're forgetting which is what, and distal, mesial, up, down, left, right, front, back, just use a different file. And we know that we place the head shrimp file in our lingual canal. So right away, immediately, like, okay, my lingual canal is short by. I don't know, let's say two, two and a half millimeters. And my buccal canal is pretty much right on the money. So you know what? For learning purposes and make life easier, just use a headstrom file if you need to. Not every clinic has headstrom files, I totally get it, but you can use a rotary endodontic file just in the same manner as your as a headstrom in this case. And a different radiographic pattern will help you determine which canal is which. Michael, what are you doing? What do I do? And don't forget to like, subscribe, and place your comments below. Cheers.